If you've ever gotten lost looking for a property on the mountain and you pretty much swear it should be right where your navigator says you're going, you definitely don't want to miss this episode of Ask Us Anything. Hello and welcome to another episode of Ask Us Anything where we answer your real estate questions about not just the real estate industry but also about areas or anything you're curious about with real estate. So if you have a question, go ahead and put it in the comments down below. We'll write it down on a slip of paper and who knows, maybe your question may be answered in an upcoming episode. In the meantime, I'm Teresa Grant, team lead for Teresa Grant and Associates Real Estate Partners at Caldwell Banker Sky Ridge Realty. And with that very long introduction, we're just going to dive right in and see what is in the bowl for us today on the magic Ask Us Anything bowl that our admin made for us for this month. This is the February 2022 edition and let's see what today's question is. I tried to find a house but the address didn't exist. What's up with that? Um, I'm going to assume that you were driving around and maybe you were using um, Waze or Google, Google Nav or something like that and you couldn't find an address. It's actually pretty common up here on the mountain to have a property that you swear it's supposed to be right here. You know it's supposed to be right here and it's not. Chances are it's because it's actually on what we call an access road. Up here on the mountain we have county paved and maintained roads that are well paved and maintained by the county which includes snow removal in the winter time. But also because of our topography and because we've got um, you know, the different rolling hills and over in Crestline, the lake's down at the bottom of a bowl and in Lake Arrowhead, the lake's down at the bottom of a bowl. You kind of get the idea. Um, sometimes we have what are called access roads. Those access roads are usually, they can be paved, but not necessarily maintained. Sometimes they're dirt, sometimes they're gravel. But when the house is built on this access road, the county assigns an address for the nearest street to it. So for example, one of the most um, illustrative ways is to think about as you're driving around Lake Arrowhead and you're on North Bay Road. We've got addresses that are actually on North Bay Road, but there's plenty of access roads that are actually a little bit beyond North Bay Road where people have built homes and um, their nearest address is North Bay. So what you have to do is when you feel like you're kind of like really close to that address and you're looking down at your nav and you're like, it's supposed to be right here and the address numbers are skipping, look for an access road. Access roads kind of look more like little driveways or alleyways and sometimes they'll be posted with multiple addresses on them. They'll either go upbound or downbound between two properties and just go ahead and go on an adventure and take one of those access roads. Eventually you'll find the right house. So I hope that helps. That's pretty much why you're not finding addresses nine times out of ten. The house does exist. It's just on an access road. That's it for today. I'm going to go ahead and say, if you don't want to miss any of our little snippets of Ask Us Anything, remember to like and subscribe so that you get alerted every time we put out a video. I'm Teresa Grant, and I'm going to call it done for this episode. So bye for now. <laughs>